Hello there and welcome back to my videos. In this video I want to speak about uh, the Flask in Python and how you can send in the logging for the emails. Like if you want to log error, then we want to send it to the Sys administrator so they can inform the developers to fix the issue. And to do to do this I will prefer to to import uh, logging and then we want to say from logging we need uh, the handlers and for this we need the SMTP handler so we can send in the data for the email if we want this and then we need a little bit more we need the mail handler to uh, to set up uh, the SMTP so we know what happening here and in this case we have the mail host if you only have uh, a SMTP server and you know everything about that oops we have an error here um, and you know this is a default port number and then you basically can use the IP address or the domain name but in my case I run a sandbox mode locally host so I need um, to define the port number and then you can do this to use the topple in, in the mail host. Then we need the, the from address for this. The from I will call it server uh, at uh, flask test.localhost, something like that. And then we say to address, and this should be the element flask test.localhost. And we need the subject. This could be system error log. That's fine. We need uh, a list here because we can have multi uh, multi uh, receivers. It could be the admin, or it could be uh, something else you want. But we keep it simple here. Then we need to set the level for the mail handling. Uh, set level. For this, we only need to to the errors. So if we have an information or debug something like that, we're not sending the mail out, and that's very interesting because I was sending for debug, then the receiver will get spammed totally. Then we have the handler here again, and we need to set the, the formatter. It's not necessary, but it's fine. Locking format. And then we need uh, this and say and the level name and then level name in. Oops. Model S, and then we need the message. And then that should be what we need here for, uh, for the configuration. Now we are ready to, to test it. The only thing we need to do now it's going inside, um, inside here and say uh, app logger. Uh, add handler, uh, mail handler, and that's not correct. We move it here down uh, below the, the Flask application, so we know we set the, the mail handler configuration here, so Flask know that. And now we are ready to add log levels. We need the info here, uh, logging info. And then we need the warning, and then we need the error, and we need debug. Just to show what it is. So let's test it out. Let's go into the browser. And here I can see I get the mail here. This is my test. You can see from system error 
and element and then we have the error here just for fun let's go in back again and going for the editor now we're going up and say which level we want i change it from error to debug and close the server again and restart it going for the browser and say reload and now you can see we get a more here we have uh, the warning and we have the error and yeah that's it i don't know why it's sending the last out but yeah i will say only use the error probably warning but not everything because then it's totally messy so thank you so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you want to subscribe my channel to get more subs if you don't know how to subscribe to this channel you can uh, go in the right corner below and press on the thing and remember this code can be found on my uh, github uh, github uh, profile and you can follow the links down in the description i hope you hit the like button and share it with your friends and put it to a playlist and of course if you have any questions please make the comments below and i'll try to answer your questions thank you so much for watching and hope to see you next time bye